Thank you, Lieutenant Governor. If this legislation is so good for schools, and it's so good for teachers, why wouldn't we add all schools and all teachers in the bill, including for-profit schools? My amendment would add all charter school employees to MIPSERS. Currently, traditional public schools and charter schools receive the same per-pupil allowance, but only traditional public schools pay into MIPSERS. By adding charter schools into this bill, all school employees would bolster the retirement system and offer a larger rate of return for our educators. I encourage you to support this amendment and show our public school teachers that you value them as much as you value for-profit schools. Thank you, and I ask my colleagues to support this amendment. Thank you, Senator Hertel. Senator Pavlo. Thank you, Mr. Lieutenant Governor. I rise today in opposition of the amendment and uh, would just like to let people know that there is a significant amount of charter schools that are in the MIPSER system today and uh, by requiring them to join a system um, that doesn't meet their business model, I don't think it's consistent with the, um, the mission of charter schools. We don't want to load them into a system that isn't operating to their expectations, so I'd urge a no vote on this amendment. Thank you, Senator Pavlo. Senator Hertel? Just, just to be clear, uh, I don't work for the business models of charter schools, and I hope nobody in this body does. At the end of the day, I work for the people of this state. This is about actually making sure that all people are playing by the same rules. That's all we're asking for. So uh, all I ask is that we add back into the system all charter schools so that they are getting the same deal you're giving to public school teachers and public schools.